Uh, René Levesque's Mouvement Souveraineté Association is off and running in Montreal tonight, with a platform calling for an independent Quebec where the French language and culture would be dominant and official. There was a clash between Levesque and the other strong figure in the movement, Françoise Aquin, who argued for nearly complete unilingualism. After the convention, Levesque talked to Norman de Poe and Blair Fraser. Uh, what happens if the rest of Canada doesn't accept your program? Do you ever start any kind of negotiation, supposing you're in the union, to give a simile? Do you ever start any kind of vital negotiation by saying, supposing we don't uh, realize the essentials of this negotiation? I don't even accept the idea that eventually we won't realize something which won't be necessarily according to all the detailed lines of what we call the, you know, a hypothèse of association. But there's no possible reason except the reluctance to accept something which isn't there yet, which is normal. There's no possible reason, either on the map or in reality, that we cannot be good neighbors with the kinds of links between Quebec and the rest of Canada, which we call an association. You, you want to call it something else, call it something else. Uh, granted that you, you didn't go into this thing uh, with uh, failure in mind. No, but suppose, and there won't be failure. Suppose the rest of Canada turns out to be pretty unreasonable about it all. Uh, what steps could you take or would you take if the rest of Canada uh, was stubborn about this business? Look, if you look at our basic papers, which are still preliminary uh, papers, I think your answer is there. Supposing, which I exclude, but supposing for argument's sake, since you insist, Norm, that uh, it isn't possible, wh what we say, I think, uh, in a nutshell, is this in those papers. In due time, it would come. And then, in the meantime, a sovereign Quebec would just have to do what dozens of other peoples in the world have done. Are we more stupid than others? In other words, set out on our own. Uh, well, again, I, uh, I'm sorry to keep at this, Ronnie, but... Uh, You're sure you're fight... har harping on it. Well, would you, uh, let's put it this way. Let's get right down to the real cases. There's a novel out on this very subject. Would you fight if you had to? Would you what? Fight. You mean fight with arms? Yes. Would the rest of Canada yes. fight to keep Quebec in... I don't know. ...against its own will? I know it won't. Because I think the rest of Canada, first of all, has no illusions on that score, and second, is civilized. 